Hi friends, welcome to Vedrano Tech. Today I am going to show you how to use command based language on Android phones. Currently all Android users are using graphical user interface to handle Android device. So what is graphical user interface? This is the graphical user interface where everything is available on single touch. So I am today I am going to show you something different that is the way to handle same thing using command based language. So let's see how to handle the same thing using command based language. Let's see how to install terminal emulator from play store. So first of all we have to go on play store. After opening play store type terminal emulator. So first one is available terminal emulator for android. So click it on same and install it. I have already installed so I have open option to open directly. So I am opening terminal emulator. This is the terminal emulator. This is the black window emulator where we can. Here I am showing you the some basic commands of android device. So first of all I am showing ls command. The ls command is a command is showing directory listing. So I am typing ls and after typing ls you have to enter. This is the folders available on particular path that is sd card sd card 1 storage sys system vendor many folders and files are available in this folder so we have used ls command to listing this folder so i have to go it on sd card folder sd card folder is a folder where our memory card is available where images files uh, data music all other folders are available in our sd card folder which we are using daily sd card folder so i have to go it on sd card folder so first of all you have to type cd cd means change directory command if you have to go on any folder you have to type cd command so i am entering cd space hd card after entering cd space hd card we are entering into cd card folder so here showing cd space hd card and after entering cd space hd card i have entering into hd card folder so i am listing the what are the folders and files are available in hd card folder so i am typing again ls command so ls command is showing there what are the folders available in hd card this is the share it whatsapp media image screencast we know this many folders are available there so i am typing next command that is pwd command pwd command is a command is showing the current working directory so it is displaying the currently in which path you are so i am typing pwd and entering so here showing slash hd card means we are in hd card folder so i am doing next command the next command is the move command move command means if you are if you like to move one file to another folder so we are using mv command so entering mv space here i am moving stk.txt file to we know this folder so i have type mv space stk.txt space the folder name where we have to move the file via an od we know the s after folder given slash so i have type mv space stk.txt space we know the s slash enter it the command executed successfully so we have to go it on we know this folder to check the files are available or not so I'm again using cd space win cd command to change directory command so I'm going in cd space we know the s folder entering it so again we have to type ls command to see the folders list where our stk.txt is available so there is showing stk.txt which is successfully moved in we know this folder so next command I am going to show you that is copy command that is that is the command where we can create the copy of one file okay so i am typing cp cp is a command 
आफ्टर सीपी स्पेस एंटर एस टी के डॉट टी एक्स टी दैट इज द मेन फाइल एंड आई एम कॉपिंग द सेम फाइल सो आई हैव टू टाइप डिफरेंट नेम एस टी के वन डॉट टी एक्स टी ओके आई हैव टाइप सी पी स्पेस एस टी के डॉट टी एक्स टी एंड द न्यू फाइल नेम इज एस टी के वन डॉट टी एक्स टी आफ्टर की वन कमांड प्लीज एंटर कमांड एग्जीक्यूटेड सक्सेसफुली अगेन वी हैव टू टाइप एल एस कमांड टू शो द लिस्ट ऑफ डायरेक्टरीज यर कमांड वॉज सक्सेसफुली एग्जीक्यूटेड दिस इज द एस टी के डॉट टी एक्स टी दैट इज द ओरिजिनल फाइल एंड वी हैव क्रिएटेड वन कॉपी फाइल दैट इज एस टी के वन डॉट टी एक्स टी मीन्स द कमांड वॉज एग्जीक्यूटेड सक्सेसफुली अगेन आई एम शोइंग नेक्स्ट कमांड दैट इज हाउ टू क्रिएट फोल्डर थ्रू कमांड सो फॉर क्रिएटिंग कमांड वी हैव टू यूज एम के डी आई आर कमांड सो आई एम टाइम एम के डी आई आर स्पेस स्पेस वी हैव टू गिव द फोल्डर नेम विच यू वॉन्ट टू क्रिएट सो आई एम क्रिएटिंग विनोद फोल्डर विनोद फोल्डर सो आई हैव टाइप एम के डी आई आर स्पेस विनोद प्रेस एंटर कमांड एग्जीक्यूटेड सक्सेसफुली If the command is not executed successfully, then they will show automatically error. When the command executed successfully, then they will not show any message. So I have created mkdir space window. Then means window folder was created. So I am again typing ls command. So see, there is window folder was created. So the command was executed successfully. So now I am going to show you how to remove file and folders. using command window so uh, first of all i am deleting files so to remove files you have to use rm command so i am typing rm space currently i am deleting stk.txt folder uh, txt file so i have type rm space stk dot txt press enter command was executed successfully so i have to type again ls command to see the effect see this stk dot txt was deleted means command executed successfully and next command is showing how to remove folders so the same command that is rm but we have to use dir folder dir command to delete the directory so we have to type rm dir r to remove directory then type rmdir space vinod after entering the vinod folder was automatically deleted so i am entering command executed successfully again we have to type ls command see this vinod folder was automatically deleted okay. next command is showing ts command ps command is a command showing the what are the process are currently running on your android device so yeah, i have type ps entering here the list of processes are running on your android device this is given with a pid i am showing you this is a name from which folder the process are running given the pid pid v size rs okay so here showing the what are the background process are running on your android device okay so next command i am showing you date that is date the date command is showing the current date so i am typing date entering it so this is the date wednesday august 17 and time indian standard time 2016 so this is the date command now i am showing up time command up time command is a command is showing when you have last rebooted your phone so this is the up time enter it so there is showing my last phone was uh, switch off and switch on on 828 and this is idle since 323 okay this is the uptime command and next command i am showing you the df command 
df command is a command is showing the size of your dicks so i am entering df space enter so here is a showing the folder size 30 mb 28 mb is available many folders and files are available this is the dev folder where 420 is size use 68 kb free 420 mb and again i am to showing you hd card folder this is the hd card where 4 gb is size and use is uh, 3.2 gb is use and 827 memory is available this is the use of df command these are the basic commands of android phones uh, if you satisfy with this video please share us please like us and if you have any suggestion for my channel so please suggest on comment thank you for watching video thank you